Hey guys, welcome to Us in Five. Today we're going to be cooking oysters and uh, a seafood crab uh, boil. Alright, so yeah, mussels here. You can see, let me turn it that way. And then crab legs, which are here. No crab legs, right? There's no crab legs. You got a bunch. Mm -hmm. Then I got some chicken broth because I don't think we had any more. And you'll see all this stuff while we do it, but I got some eggs and stuff. Anyway, um, so we'll get started on that. I'm gonna actually go ahead and start cleaning these oysters and getting them ready to be put in the oven. So I'm trying to clean all of this dirt and sand off of these shells. Kind of accumulate them in those cracks get all that mess out of there before I put them in the oven look how dark that water is too y'all you know them things was dirty yeah they dirty so Tasha and I probably do this like one time with all of them and then yeah. do it again until the water is clear mm, see that dirt coming up out of there oh so nasty yeah, put more water in and try it again I didn't clean them. Um, I'm going to place them on a baking pan with the bottom of the shell up to kind of create that cup so the juices can kind of stay inside the oyster shell. Spread them apart like this. And then put them in the oven for 8 minutes at 435 degrees. Guess what? I did not realize that those oysters were still living. Yeah. Those oysters were, are still living, y'all. And now <laughs> they about to go in there and die. You know how stinking, how bad, how nasty they would be if they were dead. Oh and my god. Well, all the other seafood rotten. is dead. Yeah. But this is they living don't have a good still. Life. Oh my goodness. So, um, we have Tashon. He actually got six. I mean, twelve. But we're gonna do six today and then six another day because we still got other food to eat. We have water boiling here because we're gonna um, do our eggs. Yep. Oh, and my sister got um, me these. So you just put your egg in here and it just comes right off real easy. You don't have to deshell it. Indeed. So that helps a lot. I'm gonna add the chicken broth to this pot. Chicken broth to that. And then I'm gonna add not this much but half of this of the data rants. This is one fourth, but I'm not gonna do um actual one fourth, probably half of that. I just don't have another uh measuring uh spoon. So this right here give it a um, little kick, give it some spice. Start letting that kind of boil on its own. So this is what Tashawn just used, the chicken broth uh, 14 ounce can that he put in here. And what he's doing right now is he's adding water to that can to add to the boil. And um, also, that sauce that he used is this one right here. Zatarin shrimp and crab boil sauce. And I was telling you that this sauce is um, very, very spicy. And it's concentrated, so um, you don't need a whole lot. And now he's adding some more water. So Tashawn has his own pot, and I have my own pot. And those are the eggs over there this boiling. And now we're going to go ahead and cut up some onion and um, celery to put in here. I'm going to put a little, bit more, uh, a little bit of Obey seasoning. Uh, seafood seasoning in the water as well. Oh, you need to put it on the other side. You know you be pouring it in there. Yeah. <laughs> we like our we like our boy um, boil spicy. When we did it for our company, we didn't do it really really spicy, but we kind of like our spicy seasoning. We got the uh, celery, onions, garlic, sausage, lemon, 
in both pots and then we're gonna put the eggs um, in and it should slide right out yeah we just use some um, cooking spray a there bit, we go. and it slides right out and just drop it in and then it's a clean finish mm -hmm. This is hot. I'm gonna have to wait for it to cool off a little bit. All right. So anyway, you saw it. Um, the eggs go in. So we'll put four in this pot and then four in this pot. So that's our. And then we're gonna um, add the crabs and the mussels to it. And then, all right. So we got the crab legs, the mussels, the shrimp, all in here cooking. I'm gonna put the lid on these, and then um, give them maybe three or four minutes and then everything will be ready so this is what we have this is Lachey's pot and uh, this is mine here I'll drop the lid on those and then let it let it do its thing and then we'll come back to it all right the oysters are ready and Tashawn is Cracking the top. There's the ocean inside. Mm -hmm. And he's gonna eat it. Is it overcooked? Yeah, I cooked it a little too long. But yeah, we cooked it a little bit too long, but it's fine because you could actually fry them if you want to. And I'm gonna put some lemon pepper seasoning on it. Just a little bit with some Texas pea. It's a good. My mouth watering. I can't wait. Good. Perfect. So this is our first time actually cooking oysters at home ourselves. So I think next time, because we said we was gonna leave it in there for eight minutes, but we end up doing it for twelve minutes. About twelve minutes. So it's a little overcooked. But our food back there is boiling for the seafood boil, and um, I'm about to. Appetizer. Yeah, this is our appetizer. So I'm about to go ahead and crack into mine. I'm gonna put this, I'm gonna set it up um, so you can see how the rest of it looks. Is it that good? Delicious. Ooh, that's too much. Oh, okay. You pull it out with your finger or you did it with a knife? Oh, just bad with your finger. Mm -hmm. Good. It's better than a restaurant, do you think? Mm -hmm. How much was it for 12? $7.99. So for 12 oysters, fresh or oysters, it was $7.99. It's not bad. You can get 12. But it is a little bit of meat. Tiny. But it's so tasty. That's right. They saw the shell. Delicious. I'm so glad you got this for me. This was my surprise. That Sean brought me. Yes, I went to Harris Cedar to get the crab legs. And then I saw the ocean. And she's been talking about it for like probably about three weeks. But I went to the grocery store and they didn't have any. 
<laughs> so I saw a whole pile of them uh, in the fresh market section, fresh seafood section. So I thought about Lache. Give her this uh, aphrodisiac. <laughs> right. Get everything right. Get everything moving real good. He was thinking about both of us. No, no, of course not. Why don't you eat it then? Mm -hmm. How are those eggs? It's so good. Oh man, I messed my fingernails up. All right, anyway, it's so good with the um, hot sauce, with the lemon pepper. With the lemon pepper and the hot sauce, it's so good. Cause, uh, you got that pepper, you got that lemon, you got that spice. This is my last one, I can't believe it. Mm. Appetizer. That right there. That was everything. So good. Delicious. Oh, it wasn't enough though. Now I wish we would have did all 12. But that's okay because we got crab legs, um, shrimp, mussels, and um, <clears throat> crab legs, shrimp, mussels. And um, eggs. You can smell it. <coughs> Woo! Spicy. All right, so we finished with the seafood boil, and I'll show y'all how the pots look. So this is mine. I got the eggs. I got some crab legs. If you look under here, you see some uh, mussels and shrimp and. A lot of stuff under there see that steam coming off that pot I'm about to tear this up got some sauce over here looks pretty good got some onions in it that, that so now I got a lemon got my cutters ready and she got her stuff ready she ready looking at my water my water she she can't get to it fast enough. Mm -hmm. Alright, that's her what's her little get up. Looks good. Alright, so let's get started. Alright. Is it spicy? Ooh. Is it? Nah, ain't spicy. Okay, I'm trying this muscle. This is the sauce. So we did the um, Be Love sauce, which is so good. Mm -hmm. We had it for the, when we invited everybody over <clears throat> uh, for our seafood board. So my brother and sister and their significant others came over. Boy, that sauce was a hit. They loved it. Right. Mm -hmm. You all right over there? I'm trying to get it out. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I love the sauce. Mm. <coughs> <coughs> Spicy. Look. I got a little kick to it. It's good when you like dip this. Mm. When I do it like that. And scoop that up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna put a little Suck lemon. that juice. A little lemon on that. Mm. Mm -hmm. Celery. Let me see how celery is. Mm. Let me try these mussels. Even the vegetable is good. Let's try this mussel. That's good. Get that in that sauce. That onion on it. Mmm. I'm about to get another one of those. That was too good. The muscles are good. Aren't you glad that we got those? Mm-hmm. That's all sitting there. Mm-hmm. Uh, 
Too good. Too good. I'm glad you recommended this. What, today? Mm -hmm. Yeah, y'all. I told Tashawn, Tashawn, do you want some crab legs today? And guess what he said immediately? He said, no. I said, oh, okay. And I didn't say anything else. I didn't say, please. I didn't say, come on. Cause I don't know what to take, like, you know, for an answer. Not really. Mm -hmm. Without, like, keep talking about it. Exactly. But this time I did. And about an hour later, he said, you want to go to the store and get some crab legs? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe sometime I need some convincing. The thing of it is, is that after he told me no and I didn't say anything, he was like, Well, yeah, I just ain't trying to really eat no crab legs. And, you know, because I just, and I'm like, It's fine, you said no, so you don't have to keep on telling me no. But if he really wanted, she should have just convinced me that we both wanted. No, he said he wanted, so. All right. We did just have a big seafood boil, so I didn't want to be like, you know, be trying to do too much. Mm -hmm. Okay, we got a little baby shrimp here. Let me try this out. And it's so, ooh, it's hot. And I dropped it. So, what's your favorite thing so far? To be honest with you, my favorite thing is the mussels. Me too! That's crazy. My favorite, I would never expect that. My favorite thing right now are these mussels. They're mussels? Yes, because when you get it like that, and you dip it in this sauce, and you scoop that sauce up with that onion and garlic and good, goodness in it, and you take a bite, mm. Mm. So hot. And so hot. So good. Mm. I can work with it. Oh. Uh. You all right? Yeah. Look at that with that onion on it. <coughs> Woo! Spice. Look at the onion and the sauce on it. The two for six mm. makes a match. So good. Only mm. a virgin. It can't get to be rough on skin. Rehydrate and strengthen your skin to bounce back. Made a little egg. Have you tasted any of your eggs yet? No, I don't. <coughs> Me either. I tasted them. Let me taste the egg. So hot. Too hot for me right now. I have to come back to it. Have me some of this. Uh, uh, <coughs> excuse me. Grab leg. Mm. <coughs> hey, good. Mm. Ooh, that cute little meat right there. Sure. Alright, let me try this egg again. See if it cooled off a little bit. Put some of this egg, I mean this onion on it. Mm -hmm. The egg is been good. Hot though. I'm going to leave that there for a second. Still hot. 
My egg, uh huh. Like once I get into it, you good. Hot. Mm. If you want my lemon, you can have it. Oh, you don't need it. I don't need it. This right here. Yeah, I make sure I get every piece of crab meat that's in the shell. Mm -hmm. I leave no shells unturned. I want to go because I want to see him get his shoes. Oh, I need to be trying to find his shoes. Oh, look at this. That's cute. Mm. That's a lot of meat, though. It's not the meat like you're finding your peen crabs. Mm -mm. Alright, guys. So, we couldn't really um, eat all of it. It was way too much. But we put a good den in it, as you can see. And so, um, I guess we'll eat the rest of it later on. But anyway, thanks for watching our seafood boil. And we'll see you later. Bye bye. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> <laughs>